The Units and Rulers tab in the Preferences panel allows you to change the resolution, size, and settings of the measurement tools within Photoshop. So as you can see, I've got the rulers already brought up and I've got a couple of guides here. Let's go into the Units and Rulers tab in the Preferences menu. Two ways to get there. Drop down in the Photoshop menu to the Preferences sub-menu and just click on Units and Rulers. On the PC, you're going to find that here in the Edit menu, down by Keyboard Shortcuts and Menus instead of the Photoshop menu. So, Units and Rulers. Or, we can hit Control k and just click on the Units and Rulers tab. The first two sections of this panel won't change anything size-wise, it'll just change how the size is reported to you. For instance, over here in Rulers, right now I'm having them reported to us in pixels, but if we drop down, we have all different options. We have inches, and you can see that our rulers up here and to the left automatically switch to the inches. Uh, centimeters, millimeters, points, pikas, percent. I usually I leave that on pixels or sometimes inches if I'm working in print work. Type can be points, pixels, or millimeters. This one I usually leave in points unless I'm working with pixel fonts that have to be a specific size and then I switch it down to pixels so that I know that when I click on 8 it's exactly 8 pixels high so that that's native to the font that I'm using. Pixels or points either way is fine. Points are more for print work and pixels are usually for web work. Column size is a unit of measurement used in the new image size and canvas size dialog boxes. This is basically where you decide what column size is used in those windows and it helps you to size images that are going to be laid out in columns. Uh, so again, your options are inches, centimeters, millimeters, points, and picas. Same with the gutter. We go to new document preset resolutions. This is essentially where Photoshop comes to decide how large you want to work when it opens up a new document. 300 pixels per inch is basically standard for print resolution. Print needs to be extremely high resolution because uh, it has to hold up close to the eye. Screen resolution is essentially going to always be 72 pixels per inch because that's the, that's the standard resolution of monitors. So here you can change this. Even though screen resolution is, is 72, I usually like to set this at about 150 because I like to have extremely crisp images uh, when I'm printing out for the web. If we drop down here to point and pica size, basically you're always going to use postscript. Traditionally in print work we've used well, the traditional size. It's just a difference in, in 0.27 points per inch. In modern work everybody uses the postscript size. This percentage has just fallen by the wayside over time. That's it for the units and rulers panel. If you have any questions please send them to requests at mahalo.com and don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe below. Thanks for watching.